Wow, that was terrific. Your dance will make our international festival really special. Thanks, Min. What's the name of that dance, Crystal? It's called the Umbrella Dance and comes from Cambodia. I can't wait till my mom and Nana see it. Yeah, yeah I really like yeah. it. See you tonight. Okay, bye. Bye. Bye, bye. 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 all these dolls. They're from all over the world. This one is from Holland. Do ladies wear dresses like that every day? No, I think they dress pretty much like us, but they wear this outfit at special times. <laughs> I like the hat she's wearing. <laughs> Good day, everybody. <laughs> oh, that is a cute hat, Kathy, but uh, how do you like mine? That's a great hat, Barney. <laughs> Thank you. It's from a place called Australia. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I see things from all over the world. What's going on here? We're getting ready for our international festival. Oh. All of us at school have made these booths with different things to see. We're going to bring our families tonight to see it all. Ooh. See all the dolls from other countries? Oh, is this your booth? No, that's not our booth. You'll see it later. Oh, well, anyway, you sure could have fun with any of these dolls. And look at all these clothes. Oh, this must be your booth. No, that's not our booth either. Oh, I'm sure we'll come to it soon. I can't wait to see it. Boy, oh boy. Oh, that's a great sombrero, Carlos. I think so, too. Ooh, and what a lovely serape, Min. It is, isn't oh, it? That's from Mexico, isn't it? Senorita, would you care to dance, por favor? Clara que si. Muchas gracias. A la derecha. To the right. Two steps to the left. A la derecha. To the right. Two steps going back. Junto, junto, compañero. Together we will do a half turn. Together we will do a half turn. Oh, oh, oh. A la derecha. To the right. Two steps to the front. A la derecha. To the right. Two steps going back. Oh, very good. Gracias, senorita. De nada, senor. And thank you, gentlemen. Oh, you're very welcome. welcome. <laughs> Look at all these different kinds of houses. This one has a pointy roof, and this igloo from way up north is round. Oh, is this your booth? No, that's not our booth either. You'll see it pretty soon. Oh. This looks like a gingerbread house. You can find homes like that in a place called Switzerland. And Germany and Austria, too. Uh -huh. Hey, look at all these instruments. They look different from anything we've ever played. This kind of looks like a cow horn. Well, I guess this must be your booth. No. Hmm. Look at this drum from Africa. Come on, everybody. Pick an instrument.
what fun musicians. Oh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. These booths are very nice. They have so many interesting things to see and learn about. Let's see. We've seen a booth with dolls, a booth with clothes, one with different kinds of houses, and one with musical instruments. Oh, oh my. Whose booth is this? That's our booth, Barney. Oh, my. We haven't even started decorating it yet. That's because we haven't decided what to put in it. What are we going to do? Everyone will be here tonight, and our booth isn't ready. It'll be the only one without anything in it. Oh, I'm sure if you work together, you'll think of something to make your booth super deep. <laughs> what can we put in our booth? Someone already did dolls. And clothes. Too bad we can't do musical instruments. Hmm. Thinking makes me hungry. Maybe we'll think of something to put in our booth if we have a snack to eat. I've got some chocolate chip cookies I'll share. Chocolate chip cookies? What chocolate chip cookies? I saved them for my lunch and we can all share them. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> Chocolate chips, chocolate chips. <laughs> the cookies, they're gone. Gone? Oh, no. Oh, what? Who took the cookies from the lunch bag? Kathy took the cookies from the lunch bag. Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Then who? Hmm. Who took the cookies from the lunch bag? Ben took the cookies from the lunch bag. Who, me? Cookies from the lunch bag. Carlos took the cookies from the lunch bag. Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Then who? Who took the cookies from the lunch bag? Barney took the cookies from the lunch bag. Who, me? Yes, you. Couldn't be. Then who? You took, took the, the cookies, cookies from, from the lunch, lunch bag? bag? I'm sorry, Carlos, but I was really hungry, and I didn't think you wanted them. Oh, that's okay, Juan. But next time you should ask first. Sorry. You know, we all got extra sandwiches, because we knew we'd be working on the booth after school today. Let's have our snack now. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, my bread is square. Like a donut, Kathy. Uh-huh. My bread is called a bagel. Mmm, that looks yummy. <laughs> Look, mint sandwich opens like a pocket. It's made with pita bread. Mmm, delicious. Mine is made from a rolled up tortilla. Oh, this is making me hungry. <laughs> I think I'll run over to my refrigerator and get my sandwich. Oh. Refrigerator? I never knew Barney had a refrigerator. What the hell? Okay, let's see here. Uh, carrot sticks, apples, pickles. Oh, I love pickles. <laughs> ah, here's my sandwich behind the milk. <laughs> I can Take a bite. Wow! That's a big sandwich, Barney. Oh, just the right size. For a dinosaur, that is. <laughs> Your sandwich is made with dark bread, Barney. What kind is that? Oh, it has a funny name. <laughs> what is it? It's called Pumpernickel Bread. Pumpernickel? Pumpernickel, Pumpernickel, Pumpernickel. <laughs> That's a very funny name. For a very tasty bread. Oh, yum. <laughs> a bread and it's called pumpernickel yum yum pumpernickel pumpernickel bread hey barney has a bread and it's called pumpernickel yum yum pumpernickel pumpernickel bread hey i have a sandwich made with white bread it's delicious would you like a bite white bread white bread yum yum white bread yum yum pumpernickel pumpernickel bread Would you like a bite? Bagel, bagel, yum, yum, bagel, yum, yum, white bread. Yum, 
Yum pumpernickel, pumpernickel bread. Hey! Mine has a pocket. It's called pita bread. It's delicious. Would you like a bite? Pita pocket, pita pocket. into the couch, and the mouse liked to curl up in its favorite chair by the fire. Well, that left the hen to do all the work. The hen cooked all the meals, she washed all the dishes, she did all the laundry, and she tended the garden. <laughs> One day, while the hen was hoeing in the garden, she found some grains of wheat. So she looked around for her friends, and she called, well, help me plant these grains of wheat. <sighs> not I, said the dog. Yeah, not I, said the cat. Not I, said the mouse. And the little red hen said, bawk, 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 bawk. then I will. So each morning, the little red hen watered the wheat, she pulled the wheat, and soon the wheat began to grow tall. And when the wheat was ripe and ready for picking, the little red hen asked, who will pick the wheat? And what do you think they said? Not I, said the dog. Not I, said the cat. Not I, said the mouse. And the little red hen said, then I will. The little red hen picked all the wheat and tied it in nice, neat bundles. Then she asked her friends, who will take the wheat into town to be ground into flour? Not, Not I, I, said the dog. Not, Not I, said the cat. cat. Not, Not I, I, said the mouse. mouse. And the little red hen said, bah, 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 bah. then I will. When she returned from town with the flour, the little red hen decided to bake a loaf of sweet bread. Now the hen loved sweet bread because it was almost as tasty as cake. Once again, she asked her friends, who will help me bake the bread? Not, Not I, I, said the dog. Not, Not I, I, said the cat. cat. Not, Not I, I, said, I, said the, the mouse. mouse. And the little red hen said, then I will. The little red hen made the flour into dough and popped it into the oven. Soon the sweet smell of sweet bread floated through the house. Well, that got the other animals' attention, and they came running. But the little red hen looked at her friend and asked, Now who will help me eat this sweet bread? I will, said the dog. I will, said the cat. I will, said the mouse. 
And the little red hen just shook her head and said, bark, 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 bark. I did all the work myself, and now I think I will eat it all by myself. And she did. Every bite, every crumb. Mm, yum, 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 yum. You know, a funny thing happened after that. Whenever the little red hen asked the dog or the cat or the mouse to help her around the house, they were always ready. Mm, I think they learned a lesson. The end. Oh, yay. <laughs> what a super deep duper story, Stella. Baking bread sounds like hard work. It certainly is, Juan, but it can be lots of fun. Some breads are made from kernels of wheat, some from corn, and even rice. First, they take the grains and they mash them into a powder. You know what that's called? Flour! That's right! And we use the flour to bake breads in all sizes and shapes. Crunchy and soft, bumpy and smooth, in all sorts of yummy flavors. That's right, Barney. Why, just look at all these different kinds of breads, kids. Oh, oh. we can pick round breads and square breads some like a stick southwestern breads that we call tortillas and italian bread from my friend sophia here's a german bread that makes your tongue tickle you know i love it it's called And finally, a loaf that seems rather long. But with this French bread, you'll never go wrong. <laughs> I never knew there were so many different kinds of bread. Oh, there are even more than you see here, Kathy. Bread is one of the most important foods to people all over the world. That's it. What's it? We can use bread of the world as a bean for our booth. That'll be perfect for the International Festival. Good idea, Ben. Thanks, but Stella and Barney helped me think of it. <laughs> well, it looks as if you all have a lot of work to do. And I'm off to tell more stories to children. So, as they say in Texas, bye, y'all. <laughs> Back kids. Bye, Barney. Bye. See you real soon. <laughs> bye, Stella. Bye, bye. 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 Got all the bread we need to make a nice display for the festival. Maybe, but I think it's missing one thing. What's that, Carlos? I think we should make a loaf of our own bread to put in the booth. That's a great idea. We could make the dough here. Then I'll take it home and Nana and I will bake it right away. Let's go. <laughs> and for you. Has everyone washed their hands? Yes. Okay, then, let's go. First, we'll have to measure the flour. Step one to make the bread, we have to measure flour. Measure flour, yes, that's the way we make a loaf of bread. Okay, now, time to pour the water. Step two to make the bread, we have to pour the water. Pour the water, that's the way we make a loaf of bread. And now we'll stir it up. Yes, we made a loaf of bread. <laughs> 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 Hi, 
<laughs> oh, what great bakers you are. Looks like we're all finished. And you made it all by yourselves. <laughs> now I'll take it home to Nana and help her bake it for us in her oven. <laughs> You've only put half the dough in a baking pan. What are you going to do with the rest of it? That's a surprise, Barney. Oh. <laughs> We've got something special planned for that dough. Oh, I just love surprises. <laughs> I'll be back as soon as our bread is baked. See you later. Okay, see you. We're back. <laughs> Let's go outside and start decorating our booth. Oh, still, oh, 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 pandas. <laughs> oh, now look at your booth. It's super deep, duper. <laughs> wow. Our booth looks as nice as all the others. Hi, Kathy. How did our bread turn out? Perfect. See? Mmm. It smells great. Good job, Kathy. Thanks. Nana and I baked it together. It turned out just right. It looks beautiful. And delicious, too. And we made it. I like all the booths. But I think yours is the most special. Your families will be very proud of you. And I am, too. <laughs> but, um, what's in the basket under the napkin there, Kathy? <laughs> it's a little surprise for you, Barney. A surprise for me? Oh. Everywhere in the world, people love bread. But here's a loaf of bread to show you that we love you. Oh, a heart. <laughs> Thanks, everyone.
enjoy exciting pictures and cool stories when you watch Storytime. Weekday mornings at 10 on AETN, where learning is always fun. Coming up next is The Puzzle Place.